Hey everybody, it's the Warlordian here, also known as the Latte Cookie. And uh, you can just call me the Latte Cookie today. Because, I mean, look at my profile picture. And um, today, I've decided that I'm going to go check out this uh, new cartoon. And uh, a lot of stuff here. <sighs> So I do know about this new I literally find that on a YouTube video I downloaded some time ago. Also, if my voice sounds a bit too low, I've been kind of sick lately. I've been I've been coughing nonstop, and it's and I'm definitely gonna do some coughing in this video. <coughs> like that, you know, it's me coughing right there. But anyways, uh, what this show is about is it's called Media Hero. And from what I've seen, it looks interesting. Like, I, it looks like the premise is actually good. I'm like, freaking Sea Princesses. Because, uh, Sea Princesses is a trash cartoon. It's so bad. <sighs> okay, what's this? Sorry guys, uh, I saw something from a friend of mine named the Hey Guy. So the Hey Guy, if you if you watch this video, you got a shout out, I guess. I, I suppose you or at least you've been mentioned in this video for some reason. But yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, sorry about that. Uh. So, yeah, okay, so I'm gonna go look this stuff up. It looks interesting. Um, from what I've seen, it looks it looks pretty cool. Um, but honestly, I'm kind of anxious. like I've never seen this cartoon before. But I can already I can already tell it's gonna be much better than Sea Princesses because Sea Princesses is so garbage. So before we dive in, um I just wanna let you know that I just wanna tell you how I discovered it. Um Nala, what are you doing? Oh, my cat Nala is doing something weird. I don't know what the heck she he's doing. Uh, if I ever mentioned that Nala was like a girl, it's actually Nala's actually a boy. Um we had to went to the went to the vet one day and like the vet and you know it, they said it was like a boy, so I'm honestly kind of nervous. I don't know why I decided to open up a new tab. Maybe Fleet of Happy Heroes here because it's something I'm used to for some time. Oh goodness, uh, I swear I may I may go off topic a lot in this video, but I'm just nervous. I've never seen this cartoon before. It's just part of who I am. I mean, I've been doing stuff like this ever since I've been walking into new cartoons. I've never heard the voices of the characters. I've never heard the theme song or anything like that. So I'm just going to take a look and see what it has to offer. <clears throat> so like I said, I, uh, I am going to be coughing a little bit in this video because of my sickness. So if that annoys you, I'm deeply sorry. <sighs> Media Heroes English. Okay, we can watch the first episode here. Sahara Desert, Africa. So the logo looks pretty cool. It's like an atom and an M and H. Synapse retrogenesis and post awareness confusions. Help us fight climate change and save planet Earth. So this is one thing I actually like about this is that it has a it has a decent premise about you know. Something is drying up on the oasis. Is... 
So, um, the outro music of season two. So there's two seasons. That's the same amount of season sequels as it has. And from the looks of things, I don't think these episodes are too long. Like seven minutes, that isn't too long. So I don't know what to expect. Um, I've no, I don't know anything about the show. I mean, I know a little bit about the characters, but I know nothing about the show. Oh crap, 26 minutes? I thought this thing was going to be like just one minute. Oh my goodness. <sighs> so, uh, like I said, I don't know what to expect. <sighs> I don't know what to, I just don't know what to expect. I've never seen this show before, so. So, of course, it's copified. <sighs> Screw copper, bro. And if I never have any ads, I mean, I do have uBlock up, uBlock Origin. <sighs> yeah, it actually works, but I don't know how long it's going to work. Let me drink some water real quick. So what's the quality like? Oh, it's actually better than Sea Princesses. Or at least the resolution, at least. But how's the overall show? That's what I want to know. Yeah, there's no description, so I don't know what to expect. I'm going to mute it. Just because I don't I want to... I don't want to get, like... I don't know if this stuff's, like, copyrighted or something like that on YouTube. I mean, it... it it's... I mean, it's on YouTube. I, I don't know, bro. This thing has not even 20,000 views, or it almost has 20,000 views. Not even 150 people like it. I mean, I don't know the dislike, though. Well, at least we all know that YouTube didn't completely remove the dislike feature. We just can't see how many people disliked it. <sighs> like I said, I may go off topic a lot in this video. I'm going to try to stay on topic as much as I can. But like I said, I've never seen this cartoon before. But from what I've seen, it looks interesting. And it may go up there with stuff like Happy Heroes and Cookie Run. Let's hope it doesn't end up being trash like Sea Princesses. Because this show actually looks like looks promising. The premise is, the premise is cool because it... it, it, it uh, what's the freaking word? Uh... It covers a topic that's kind of big today, you know, considering, you know, people just don't give a crap about certain things. They're just making all the ice melt. <sighs> so, and also, I may pull up to this Happy Heroes screenshot a lot. You've seen this screenshot a lot. I, I'm obsessed with it for some reason, but I just am. Yes, I do have Age of History 3. It's so... I mean, what I'm going to say about Age of History 3 is that it's good. It's a, it's a flawed game. It has a few issues, but I still like it. <sighs> okay. Oh, guys, I'm so freaking nervous. How long have I been doing this? Eight minutes? Holy crap. Oh, wow. Also, I apologize for the quality. Uh, Hold on, let me try to bring it up a little bit. I don't want to bring it up too high because my internet's still crap. <clears throat> this looks cool. Okay, hold on. I, I I only got to see like a small frame of the intro. Oh, that was back. I mean, should I unmute it? I I don't know. This is gonna feel. This is probably gonna be regret. He just meowed at me. Oh, I don't know, man. I'm so nervous. Just like I said, this happens to me every time I discover a new cartoon. Like, I pretty much just stay outside the border for a little while until I actually go in. And uh, things have been pretty rough for me lately, especially with 
the echoing voices situation, which I'm not going to talk about because I mean, uh, I'm just not going to talk about it. Okay, it's it's not a good situation. All right. And also, a lot of crap at school has been messing me up. I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. I don't even feel anxiety. Get on nervous. I swear, something's holding me back. You see, see this down here? That's the only with voices content I'm going to stick to until everything happens again. Oh, man. I'm just going to mute it again. I don't know. I, 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 my brain can't decide. I'm, I'm so nervous. I'm so freaking nervous. Can somebody help me out here? Like I said, oh, man, I've, I'm saying I'm repeating everything now. I just need to get into it. I'm just going to mute it. So wow, this this looks cool. The animation looks nice. Wow. This is neat. The animation's definitely a lot better than Sea Princesses. Look at that. Oh! I unmuted it. I unmuted it. So, uh, I actually know this character. Uh, his name is uh, Thermo. That's his superhero name. I don't know his actual name. Like I said, I need to learn about the characters a bit more. But, believe it or not, he actually kind of reminds me of Falcon from the Marvel movies. You know, the Anthony Mackie character. I'm pretty sure you guys know what I'm talking about. Sam Wilson, yeah. And it's a and it's kind of something considering I've just went back to into into Marvel movies. I've been obsessed with them a lot back in 2020 and 2021, but by the time 2022 came and the year of Sea Princesses 2023, I, when these guys came, I was like not there, but now I'm back. So, yeah, this character's name is Thermo. In fact, there is a wiki. I'm going to try to pull it up. Yeah, I, found, I actually found this stuff on DeviantArt, believe it or not. Of all the places. I know DeviantArt is considered a bad place by most, but you can, okay, you can find, occasionally find treasure there. So I'm just going to let this sit out and I'm going to see if I can pull it up. I'm so nervous to play it again. Dang, I've been doing this for 13 minutes. I need to stop fooling around. Wow. This actually looks good. Visuals are nice. Like I said, I'm much better than sea princesses. Oh, we have like the planets. Oh, that is so cool. Oh, Pangea. Pangea. This is like the infinity stones. You got, uh, I don't know if you'll see my arrow, but I see what could be like the soul stone, the reality stone, the time stone, the space stone. We can't even see the mind in power stones, but that's okay. Oh, there's the power stone, or a representation of it. That was pretty cool. I want to hear the voices of the characters. And honestly, I'm a little nervous, but I need to be brave. Birthday to you. Sydney, Australia. Okay, cool. You can see the opera house back there. And the cake's all mine. Oh, what is that? Mm, Good day, cool. Mr. Shiny. Wow! 
Crikey, you're right there, Adam. What was making that ah. strong? So I think this dude is the main guy. His name is Adam, and he looks cool. I like his design. I like it a lot. I actually like this voice, considering he's the first character that I've heard his voice. I can't. If that doesn't make sense here, I'm sorry. <coughs> Glow! I don't know, but it was awesome! Do it again! Do it again! Do it again! Seattle, USA, Rome, Italy. I don't know why I have to say all this stuff when it's literally right there, but I guess it's cool. Okay, why is my crap not loading? I know my internet's bad, but oh my god. My internet's always bad. I swear to god. I wonder where Nala went. Lord. But the animation's good. I like the animation. Happy birthday to you! <laughs> oh, what, what is, is that? that? Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> wow! Yeah! What, what are, are you? you? Huh? What is shining like that? Buenos Aires, Argentina. Okay, so I've actually seen the designs of all the main characters. To be honest, this isn't this is the only design I really don't like. It's mostly just the hairstyle. Don't call me racist, okay? I mean, it's not. It's oh my god, what am I even saying at this point? It's just the hair. It's, it's I don't like it, okay? Oh, my internet is just so freaking bad. Why is the white stuff so slow? Do you know what my what Adam's voice reminds me of? Come on. God dang it. Oh well. Well, let's gonna give it one more shot. Harbin, China, Cape Town, South Africa. I don't know why I'm saying all the names of the places. Oh! That is not any old seashell! Something's shining there. What, what is, is this? this? Uh, wow. Wow. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. Okay. okay, best, best birthday, birthday ever. ever. The adventure begins. Yeah, sorry if I do like a little childish in this. It's my freaking autism. So how many more? How many? More? Okay. I'm just gonna watch this a little bit more because my internet is a little dog crap. I can't watch anything at all. I can't get to the wiki. I can't. Oh goodness. I don't even know if I can post this to YouTube tonight, but I'm gonna try. The Meteorology Expert Center is the most advanced climate change think tank with the best scientists in the world. It's located in the Grand Sasso because here we are in two national parks which protect nature, animals, and biodiversity. This is the perfect place for the science of environmental protection. We have one mission, save our planet. You, meteorologist Giuliacci, will be in charge of teaching what climate change is and how to fight pollution. It will be an honor to help you all save planet Earth. Unfortunately, most areas don't have the resources to act on our recommendations. But the more we learn and the more we teach, the better prepared we'll all be to fight pollution, waste, and our arch enemy, climate change itself. I only wish we had the tools to do more. Good morning! Ah. Sorry if I startled you. I am Tempest, the world's most advanced meteorological supercomputer, AI. Not boasting, well... Maybe 36% boasting. Yes, Tempest here keeps constant track of all the weather in the world. We'd be lost without him. Stop, you'll make me blush. He is blushing quite loudly. No, this is his alert mode. He warns us instantly about any unusual climate-related events. So, yeah, this actually looks pretty cool. Um, Okay, guys, I'm going to have to cut it short here. Um...
I'll give you my overall thoughts so far. It's actually really good. It has a good premise. <coughs> it's definitely a million times better than Sea Princesses because its premise sucked. It tried to spread a good message not to hurt animals, but with it, what else it did with it and how it treated humans, I hate it. It sucks. It's stupid. I wish I never even discovered it. But this, on the other hand, this is promising. This is good. And, um, I think the wiki is actually going to load, but we'll do that next video. I'm just going to create a little part two to this. Just, yeah, this is actually good. I like the premise. I like the style of animation here. I like the characters. So, uh, yeah. Anyways, um, I better head now. Bye, every bye, everybody.